What's going on YouTube? Kevin here with a video review for the Gary Fong Flipcage, which is a versatile photography tool for your iPhone and also your compact digital camera. Before I begin this review, I want to thank Robbie and the whole crew out there at Gary Fong for sending this out to me for review. Go ahead and check out the website, guys. Link will be down below in the video description as always. Since the iPhone does not have a quarter 20 thread built into it anywhere, you are going to have to use this Gary Fong tripod mount for the iPhone 4 and iPhone 4S. Now I'm not sure if this is because this was designed with the iPhone 4 in mind and then the iPhone 4S is a little bit different in terms of the dimensions, but I found this to be very, very tight onto my iPhone. Now granted, I do have screen shells on both the front and the back, and that might cause it to add a little bit of thickness, but these aren't really thick screen shields either. And you'll notice by this little clip here, you'll notice that the size of the screen shield do bubble up around where you tend to leave this tripod mount. And even when you are installing the tripod mount, it does have the tendency to peel up your screen shields on both the front and the back. So if you guys are sporing your iPhones with screen shields or screen protectors, I would suggest you either take them off if you want to use this product or just try to find a better tripod mount. But in terms of the mount, I'm not really satisfied with that. But in terms of the actual flip cage itself, it's not too bad. Installing your iPhone or compact digital camera onto the Gary Fong flip cage is pretty simple. There is a quarter 20 thread on the flip cage itself, and there is a screw on the bottom, so you don't need to use a screwdriver or any type of coin to secure this to the flip cage. Now, it does serve as a stand, and this is very helpful in many different reasons. You can use it as a tabletop tripod if you want to take photos or video using your iPhone and that great camera on the back of it. You can also use it as a movie stand, so you can watch any of your favorite YouTube videos or videos on Netflix or anything like that. You can also use it as a stand for when you are FaceTiming with friends. You can use it to prop up your iPhone just like that. And you can also use it in a macro photography style way, which is something I found pretty unique. You just kind of flip it over on the side and just kind of balance it out. And you can focus on anything pretty up close and anything that's pretty stationary. As I mentioned before, the Gary Fong flip cage is not just for your iPhone, it's also for your compact digital camera. And with a lot more point and shoots these days becoming even thinner, this is an accessory that might become a little bit more useful. The Gary Fong flip cage gets its name from the fact that you can actually flip up the sides and use this as kind of a roll cage for your digital camera. And this is more so what it shines for and what it's supposed to be used for. You can tell you can kind of bend back that little white piece of plastic there and fire off a shot. And this is more so helpful for both deflecting your flash and kind of aiming it towards your subject and also to protect your lens in case it's raining and you don't want to get water on your lens or in your lens for that matter. So for $29.95, you get a pretty versatile stand for both your iPhone and your compact digital camera. Now, what do I think? Personally, I'm not a huge fan of this accessory, mainly because of the build quality. The build quality of this product does not really feel up to par. There are a lot of still loose ends that I feel like they could polish up. But in terms of the price tag for what you get, I'm not quite sure I would spend $30 on this product, mainly because of the build quality again. But it is something worth considering if you're looking for a pretty cheap yet versatile alternative to a tabletop tripod. So this has been my video review for the Gary Fong flip cage. Again, I want to thank Robbie and the whole crew out there at Gary Fong for sending this out to me for review. Go ahead and check out the website, guys. Link will be down below in the video description as always. Until next time, please feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe for more content in the future. And I'll see you guys in the next video review.